Hello Chiefs fan. Exploded on the web. Just confirmed. DeAndre Hopkins signed a contract with Kansas City Chiefs. And I already bring all the details of this great news firsthand to you. So for you to continue receiving all these Chiefs updates, check if you are subscribed to the channel and comment below if you are already subscribed. Let's go to what matters. Ahead of the 2023 preseason and regular season, the Chiefs have high expectations for Kadarius Toney, Marquez Valdez-Skentling, and Skymore to lead the way in the wide receiver unit. Additionally, they have second-round rookie Razy and veteran Justin Watson to serve as added depth. Richie James, a free agent, is also a strong candidate to earn a spot on the depth chart. However, the group lacks proven production, and that's where the possibility of DeAndre Hopkins comes in. Even though money may be an issue right now, as reported by Fowlers, the Chiefs remain firmly in the mix. The door is still open for things to change, especially in this coming month. Insider Jeremy Fowler recently provided an update on Kansas City's interest in the services of star-free agent DeAndre Hopkins. Although Hopkins visited the Tennessee Titans and New England Patriots, he has yet to indicate his final decision on his next NFL destination. However, as mentioned by Fowler, the Chiefs kept in touch with Hopkins and expressed interest. The challenge is in the financial aspect, as the team is tight on the salary cap. One possible solution would be to extend defensive tackle Chris Jones' contract, which would free up some money to pursue Hopkins more aggressively. At the moment, the Kansas City Chiefs are on Hopkins' radar, but the deal may not happen until closer to training camp or even beyond. Other teams, such as the Titans and Patriots, are also in contention for the player. Financial hurdles have been a constant talking point, and space to add an all-pro player like Hopkins is limited in Kansas City's books. The team has just over $1 million in salary space, according to the NFLPA report. While it's widely expected that an extension for Chris Jones will come at some point in the future, there's still no guarantees as to when that will happen. The waiting time could be similar to the previous contract Jones signed in July 2020. Meanwhile, ahead of the 2023 preseason and regular season, the Chiefs will have Kadarius Toney, Marquez Valdez-Scantling, Sky Moore, and others to lead the wide receiver unit. However, the possibility of having Hopkins is still up for grabs, even if money may be an obstacle at the moment. Hey fans, do you think Hopkins comes to the Chiefs? Yes or no? Leave your opinion in the comments below and let's discuss about this subject, because this is very important for Chiefs. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel to continue receiving the latest Chiefs news. And leave your like on the video to strengthen the channel. I update you anytime with the latest Chiefs news.